So we have an instrument, it's now called a VSC. Uh, back then it was an infrared image converter. So it's designed to show similarities and differences in inks by the way they reflect and absorb infrared light. Hmm. Now in simple terms, if you remember back when you had the little decoder things that came in a cereal box yeah. and it had blue ink with red ink on top and you put the red filter and mm -hmm. you can read the blue ink, it's filtering out the red and you see the blue. So it's just a little more sophisticated than that. Uh, you shine a certain wavelength of light on it, on the ink, and then you have a camera that you put different barrier filters. So it's allowing different wavelengths to enter the camera and you can sometimes optically erase an ink, like it'll completely filter. Hmm. You can make inks glow depending on how they do or, or how they react. But the long and short is different inks will typically respond differently under some unique infrared combination. So you're able to show that, hey, there's two inks in this exact same drawing. Hmm. And by the way, the one that's added is all the critical stuff that makes it important. Oh yeah, the new stuff that made the patent legitimate. Right. So for instance, if you have a list of, okay, I invented the following things. Number one, number two, all the way through seven. And one and two are in ink A. Yeah. And then three through seven that matter are in ink B. Gee, I wonder what Yeah, yeah your add-ons, once you finally got around to it. Exactly. Once you knew what you needed to invent, you wrote those in. 